Okay, uh, this video will be an introduction, a very brief introduction to fuzzy set theory. I didn't want to dwell on it too much because fuzzy set theory is not something I'm a complete expert on. But I figured nonetheless, since we're talking about set theory, we might as well bring into the idea that there are such things called fuzzy sets. Now, what is a fuzzy set? A fuzzy set is basically uh, um, a set which has a degree of membership. Like, it's not just yes or no. Not like what we talk about, like, X is a member of A or is not a member of A. It's where there's a degree of membership, like, like MX is in between 0 and 1. Now, this 0 is if X is not an M, and 1 if X is, I mean, sorry, 0 is, yeah, 0 is not an M, and then X for 1 is fully going to contain an M. It's, it's called a... Uh, uh, this is fully included for one and then not included for zero, which kind of makes perfect sense. Now, where can fuzzy logic be applied? Well, it can be applied to exp uh, expensive, inexpensive, like you're trying to buy a car. Like it could be a range of prices, like not just, you know, you know, what, 20000 30000 It's just, it's somewhere in between. And, um, like you try to guess someone's, you know, height or something like that. Or when you have like a glass right here, let's say it's a, to 10 milliliters and 5 milliliters is half. It's instead of being full and empty, respectively, it's not just full and empty because empty would be nothing and full would be a ten. But so there's a, it's it's only it's a degree of how full it is. So that's five because so which yields that you know that the uh, that mx is uh, equal to 0.5 because between zero and one and we're just going to 0.5 is the answer. Now if it was completely empty, it would be not included zero, and if it was completely full, then it would be one, and that's just basic intro to set theory. I mean, there's not much else to the basics other than that. I mean, there's kernels and things like that, but we're not, I'm not totally an expert on that. But so this is the intro to fuzzy set theory, and I'll be wrapping it up with um, closing video shortly. I think I may just, just no, nothing, con nothing content-wise, just do like a quick wrap-up of set theory and, you know, what, what else, you know, what, what's, what does set theory hold for the future? And uh, that, that's all, that's all for, um, that's all, that's all for now. I hope you guys enjoyed my the content part of my video series on set theory. Uh, I'll be making many of other videos. Again, there'll be mathematics, non-mathematics related. Uh, some on video games, some on chess, some on other stuff. Um, okay, so that's all for now. Hope you guys enjoyed the video series, and I'll see you guys.